so she sends, she sends me a text message. She says, are you really a virgin? I say, yes. She says, how far have you gotten? I respond, what we are doing right now. <laughs> other businesses, local comedy clubs are struggling with thousands of comedians now out of work. But one local mom and pop operation is determined to keep the laughs coming by reinventing itself. And it has some big name support. Flappers. 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 Flappers Comedy Club. Flappers. 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 Flappers Comedy Club. I absolutely love flappers so much that I tried to hang the same colored curtain behind me at my house. End of February <laughs> of 2020, uh, Barb and I are getting into a disagreement over the fact that she wants to hire more people because uh, we're doing better than we'd ever done before, and she's feeling like we need we need more help to run it. Two weeks later, we were closed. like a movie theater and then I heard the news that movie theaters could open oh, and I, no. I wrote back a statement said I disregard what I said I think we are like a movie theater I mean <laughs> what do we do how do we get open so we're doing the virtual shows here's the thing about zoom show comedy is if that's all we got okay but it's not it's a different thing it's just a different thing. It was easier starting. No, it was not. Really? I mean, that was six months of 18, of just get up, go to work, until you're exhausted, go home. And this is easy in context of that. For me, I like writing jokes. I like uh, making people laugh. So every day I wake up and I go, okay, did I write jokes today? Yes, okay, did I do a, vir a virtual show or a virtual open mic? Did I make someone laugh at least one point, at least once in that? Yes. Okay. Then that's, then I had a good day today. Is, is comedy broken? No, comedy's never broken. It may be... It may be somewhat dormant at this point. Ten years. Look how far we've made it in ten years. We've. Managed to fill the place. 